We're just going to show you a small film of Lowe Blacksmith and Will Wright working together, uh, getting ready to put a, a metal band round a wooden wheel. Mr. Sergeant, he's making the fire up, ready to uh, warm or heat, as you like, the metal band which goes around the tire, around the wheel. Uh, very careful. At one time they used to use peat, but having said that, nowadays, or up to this point, I think it got too expensive, possibly. And he's carefully putting the wood around. After he's, after he's put the wood round, he comes round with paraffin, splashing it everywhere, including his feet, but I don't think it hurt too much. This is to help to burn, get an even burn all the way round the fire. Taking care, and that is where the wheel actually will go on, the wooden wheel will go on, to be able to put the tar on, and then putting the flame or fire, if you like, round the sides, getting that to burn. Now this is a waiting game now. To could take quite a while for the iron tire to heat up. And there's the wheel to be done, which is put on the on that metal base going over the spindle, or screw spindle that is, and then make certain that's okay, like that. Then putting spaces in. A block first, and then a little bit of metal. And then there's a, a wooden bar with a screw in it, which they screw in, making certain that the, your legs are out of the way because it happened to crump your leg you know all about it. And then uh, the wheel is screw that's screwed down, but it mustn't be screwed down too tight for the simple reason you would actually bend the wheel. As you can see, the smoke and that is swirling about everywhere, so you've all got smoke dried. And there's the uh, fire busy away, heating the band of metal up. which is due to go on to the tire and that which is, as you see previously, was prepared, the wheel was prepared. And there's spectators, as myself, Mr. Bill Sargent, my father, and also Mr. Hale. Another gentleman was there, I think he was just a spectator, but I don't know who he was. So as Mr. Sargent given plenty of instructions, make certain it goes down tight, he says. And there is the, where the water comes from when they quench the wheel at a later stage after this being put on. It's a pump just into an old bathtub. Now it's picked up with metal tongs, placed over the wheel taking care how it's being put on, a little bit of help at different places, just to pull it with pinches or whatever they called them at the time. And then Mr. Sergeant used to go around, tap and round, make certain it's all, all coming correctly. As you can see, the flame is, is, is getting quite high. And then they come round with the water Quenching it, getting the flame put out as quick as possible. Uh, the one in front of the, that's going round, always making certain you're just a little bit ahead, or else you get your Wellingtons or boots, whatever, filled with water as they kept pouring round. Anybody would grab a, to, uh, a can just to help out that was happened to be watching, and then at a later stage. That would all be still being quenched, of course, but at a later stage that would be took out and adjusted with a big hammer if need be. Mr. Sarge are banging away there. 
It's quite a heavy hammer, of course, as you, as you can see. Plenty of water going around there because it, it could still have a little bit of flame or a little bit of smouldered wood between the wood and the metal band. And there's my father pumping water into the old bath. Anybody could be doing that. It didn't matter who. If they happened to be standing there, somebody just go while they was watching, just go and do it. There's another tire going on. Sometimes they don't go right, sometimes they go on straight away nicely. But then they knock it in. Yeah, that one looked as though it was a bit tight, so therefore they have to have some prongs to pull it a little bit tighter to pull it to that side. And then, uh, it is now, it's all round. The sides, then the spindles are all knocked out. And then, of course, you'll see the water come quenching around again. There's the flame. Look, see, if you let a flame too much, it burns too much wood away and um, uh, it just has a loose tar then. Some people call it a tar, some people call it a shoe, some best call it a, 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 an iron band. But uh, whatever it is, that's, that's what goes on the road as you can see. And this is how it was done when the blacksmith closed in, I think, around about the 19th. 80s, earlier 1980s.